okay, right now I have to broadcast the uh, update information about the Earth magnetic field. About an hour ago, I found that the North magnetic has fed Y up to 40 degrees. Right now, it's close to 20. It's so huge. So many energy, right? Pour to the Earth from the North, from the North Pole. You can see that. But if you take a close look, we have a few, have a few energy from our sun. You can see that. It's not really late, but at the back side, another thing happened. And we did like that, right? We got the information that right now Earth have the electromagnetic at the North Pole KP6. But right here, the energy that comes to the Earth from our sun is less than the energy that pour to the Earth from the other side, from the back or from the side. Density a lot. Right now, pressure very huge on over the Earth. And for sure that those energy pour down to the Earth's surface, to the soil, to the ground zero, and even to the Earth core. It's not good at all. Human, animal, even the tree get effect from this electromagnetic storm. You can see that. Not really come at the front of the earth. It comes from other direction. Not from the sun. Not from this. Not from this way, right? That's right. But it somewhere, somehow, under the earth or behind, some in front, another from the top. Not from the sun. The sun should be in this direction, right? But right here you got at the bottom, some at the north, some at this side, and then at this side. About last night I thought about a five, five solar wind and thunderstorm storm hit earth. If we plus our sun, it should be six solar wind or six source of the energy that hit our earth. Not good at all. And when we take a look, right now, right here, the NASA said through sweat better to come that the solar wind is only about 400 something, 400 km per second. But when we take a look, right here, sometimes it's up to 800 km per second. And you can see that energy really in the back. Some not in the back. And uh, when the milk drop down close to the satellite orbit. So far so bad, not so far so good. Some energy come in front. Some come in front with a strong electromagnetic wave storm, solar storm. You can get the green one. The green, the green one is not good. The green one means high energy, right? And at the back, again, up here, you can think at the IMF. IMF comes from our sun. Even this one looks like that it comes from our sun, but it doesn't come from our sun. Maybe something beside the sun, on the left, on the right, on the top or on the bottom. But only from the sun. Because this one is come from the sun, the IMF line, the blue line is still straight. And if it go to the when the land is still straight, but look at here in the back side had a curve around this area. No, definitely it should not come from our sun. And as NASA said, right, if we take a close look for the information from them, again, right here. It indicates that solar wind about 400 something, 400 km per second. But that we found on the other information is about 200 and 800. And right here, you can see that North Pole opened almost 20 degrees, or let's say that 40 degrees, 20 to the left, 
another twin to the right, but it's in the north. North 20, south 20. It's open so much. And the density up to 100, almost 100. Why solar wind not so strong? It just came up from about 20 something to 400. But the density of proton very huge. Why the sun have the, I say sinkhole, it's much more easy for the people to understand, but the sun, the gas, you know, the solid metal as earth. No rock, no soil, no metal. But the easy way to, to, to communicate should be the sinkhole at the sun. You see that? We found that there are three sinkholes in the 24 hour. How could it happen? Even right now, the sun still keep producing solar fare with the C-class. Every hour and hour, the energy come to hit Earth at all the time, non-stop. How could the sun have a single energy should to be sucked down, right? As I try to find out the the real reason, I found that it should be some energy put to heat against the sun solar wind and heat the sun. Maybe some gravity or electromagnetic wave that's stronger than the sun. It means some sort of energy too close to the sun. When that sun or those sun release solar fire or the CME, those solar fire simply hit the sun. Then it made it look like sinkhole at the sun. Nothing should be the same. Sunspot three one one zero should be the the one that have to make the real concern. It can produce M fair and X fair, but right now the proton not high enough, but. 3105 and 3107 have more strong proton, but the two are still less to produce M fair or X fair. But we don't know, right? In the next hour or next 72 hour, this energy might be right up immediately and release M fair or X fair. But this one not really earth direct. Therefore, earth get less energy. Earth is the same as the big battery. Right? And the sun should be the big generator. The generator produce the CME coronal ejection with the hue of plasma or electric pour to the earth and earth keep it at the core of the earth. When earth get less energy, it means when land bell very poor, very weak, very thin. It allow cosmic layer come to the earth. Don't forget that. Cosmic ray is not the light. It uh, have to say it about the the particle, very super super nano particle. Cosmic ray has nucleus and eighty five percent to ninety eight percent of that nucleus are hydrogen. When hydrogen pour down to the Earth's atmosphere, mixing with oxygen H two O, it create moisture water or crowd. This morning, I have seen so many crowd, cosmic ray crowd, a lot. Right here, right now, you can see that, look like a storm, solar storm, to hit Earth magnetic field. That solar storm not come in front, because right here, you can see when the land bell has to eat another shoe, or another side, not in the front, of the sun. Look at that. It's so big. It means some sort of energy come from behind, in the front, top or row. Right here should be about a little bit slight as a um, beside the sun. So the sun and earth those energy may be come from this way or this way. 
because it slightly hit at the side of the wetland bill, not the real direct as uh, solar storm or solar wind from our sun. It may be another evidence that some solar system approach to almost almost go to inner solar system. It means this one should indicate that those system X should part the ring of asteroid come to let's say that between Ma and asteroid ring. Take a look, not nearly good. Any more information I shall let you know. During this time just keep in your mind that a lot of energy flow to the earth and it makes our earth magnetic feel so crazy, no shape at all. Sometimes disappear. You see that? It should be a cycle or cross to cycle. But this one just as a MBO. Not really in good shape. And again, sometimes you can see four or six earth magnetic field. When people ask me why I always say that about December 31st, as on my calculation, my own information, I believe that the north magnetic field will move to the 40 degree mark within December 31st, within this year, not February, not March next year. I might be wrong. But if north magnetic field, north magnetic, move to the 40 degree mark within this year, are you ready? That is, that is my question. Are you ready? If you ready for the shelter, for the evacuation, don't worry when it will reach 40 degree mark, if you ready. But if you don't ready, you will never be ready. God bless you all. Don't forget that. FEMA warned us right this almost 20 years. No gravity, everything may be fry up and down. No electric, no communication, no mobile phone signal. What you will do when that situation occur. You have to answer this question by yourself. God be with you.